basically right now everybody's setting up in their designated spots around the studio, making sure everything's working, got the sound going right. Bop. Beatrice, the melody was just, you know, I was like, wow, what is that? It just really stuck with me. It's one of those those melodies that's very infectious, in, in, in my opinion, that you just kind of stick with you. And, and so when I really sat down with the melody and the harmony and listening to everything, I really thought about how did it make me feel. talking about really a love loss. Even though, you know, you've been left, you know, by the person that you love, you realize that, okay, there's always tomorrow and now I can move forward and I'm able to aspire to something else, meet someone new, keep it moving. You know, life goes on. It doesn't stop with someone not loving you or not wanting to be in your life. And so I wrote it that way. I think that's really the first question I always think of, you know, especially if I'm writing the lyrics to, let's say, another already, you know, an instrument tune that's already written. How does it make me feel? You know, I feel like if I can get to the core of that, then I can be as honest as possible with the lyrical content. So I thought it was, was fitting once again that I put this on a project, not only because I love the song, but also that song was put together. I put it together during a very integral part of my life, being a student at the Jazz School Institute put songs on the project that not only tell a story, but also they're connected with my personal life in a certain way. And so I felt it would be meaningful to put them on the project to represent, you know, really me and what I've been through the last several years. Um, with Colors of Life, what happened was a really uh, good friend of mine, great musician, composer by the name of Sean Kenner out of the uh, New York area. I asked him to actually play on my album. And then right then I was like, you know, I got this song and I just, I feel, I think it's you. It just hit me instantly. I was like, yo, this is, this is really dope. I'm feeling this. I guess he heard it and instantaneously he, he found the lyrics that's kind of downloaded right into the song itself and it just kind of really fit all together and when I actually um, sang it over with him when I was in New York the last time um, he loved the lyrics. When he got the song it instantly connected with him and the lyrics were just perfectly fit for the song so it was, it was meant to be. Yeah. Colors of life melting into We all, our blood, we all bleed, you know, we all have the same type of life force within our bodies, you know, pushing us forward and really wanted to really talk about that and have that universal um, connection that we all share. And that's really what the song is about for me. You know, there are a lot of just great things that I think a lot of us may take for granted because we caught up in a very mundane, monotonous type of lifestyle and we lose sight of what it just really means to be alive, um, what it means to be another human being, um, and really appreciate that fact.